First at four, at least six people are dead and two dozen others hospitalized after a gunman opened fire at a suburban Chicago 4th of July parade. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Brian Dorman. Danya Backus has the latest on the search at this hour for the shooter. Police in Highland Park, Illinois, say a gunman started shooting into a 4th of July parade from a rooftop in the downtown area. On a day that we came together to celebrate community and freedom, we're instead mourning the loss, the tragic loss of life and struggling with the terror that was brought upon us. Officials say shots started ringing out about 10 minutes after the parade started. At first, the crowd thought the noise was associated with the parade. Then they ran from the scene, leaving their belongings behind. Police are searching for the gunman. The suspect is currently described as a male white, approximately 18 to 20 years old, with longer black hair, a small build, and wearing a white or blue t-shirt. So far, police have recovered a rifle. This man was along the parade route. You know, it's just, just get to a safe place. Like get behind a brick pillar or something like that, which I did, and just to catch my breath. Our community was terrorized by an act of violence that has shaken us to our core. Officers are going door to door, urging people to shelter in place until the gunman is found. Several 4th of July events in nearby communities have been canceled. Danya Backus, CBS News.